So tell me about your set with Thor. So Continue. First round, you know, I won because he's playing his fox, I'm playing his duck hunt. I do my normal space now, like, can blow him up, all that kind of stuff. Next round, he decides to go, uh, decides to go Greninja, you know, the old frog. <laughs> and he absolutely destroyed my day because <laughs> he would say, don't air dodge. And then I would air dodge. And then he would kill me. And it just made me so upset because I realized how much I air dodge. <laughs> Thor will yeah. do that. Yeah, you guys are good. <laughs> what? So I didn't get to see who won the RPS. <laughs> okay. Um, hold on. Uh, okay, so Thor's player two. He's playing TDD. <laughs> and Michael Heyman is playing Wario. Uh, he's actually been going a lot of ROM today. Usually I make a joke about like, oh man, uh, Mike's playing Wario? What a, what a surprise. <laughs> no, he... <laughs> And so, the, uh, wind, so the wind box just uh, <laughs> stole the bike. <laughs> yep. It also stole uh, Rambler, as you can see him in uh, Thor's stomach right now. He's lost his match. Shoutouts to a uh, Reggie Willing. <laughs> oh, the bike's gone. The bike's floating <laughs> in the middle of space right now. He caught him in boring distance. <laughs> Gosh. Okay, so we got a 10% lead. Never mind. And his bike is gone. That's right, he can't use bike for another three seconds. Oh, it's back. Oh, it's been three seconds. Ooh, B reverse chomp. Ooh. He claps him. <laughs> Alright. Almost dies in typical Thor fashion. This is quite a wacky, wacky matchup. It's been 40 seconds. <laughs> Oh, the Gordo goes flying back. Reeds is up with a bear? Why would he up be on stage that like I I I mean there there must be method to it. I just don't know. Is there is there a method to Mike's probably madness? Not. I was gonna say probably Mike is not. just wacky today. Anyway, I know this is a very thrilling match, but what are you doing after this, Max? What am I doing? Oh, I'm going to cook out. I was. I was didn't actually, want to hear that. That was actually my plan. <laughs> well, I, if you want to come back to my place, but no, I was going to suggest Michael Hingman's house is going to be open. We're oh. going to be playing some uh, mafia. You ever heard of it? Oh, but which mafia? Like, like mafia three or mafia? <laughs> oh no, no, not the, not the video game in my idea. <laughs> No, we're going to be weeding some people out. Some people are going to be trying to kill us in the night. Some people are going to be trying to, you know, vigi us in the night. It's going to be it's going to be a good what? time, and we're trying to get as many people to come as possible. Yeah, I'll join in. That sounds great. Nice. All right, we got someone else. This is going to be the best night of Mafia ever. What is ever. this? Uh, whenever bracket's over, just immediately head over to Mike's. <laughs> you can't punish that. This is just that. getting ridiculous. You can't. You cannot punish DDD's... Full lag up be cancel and still call yourself a good person. Well, I mean you can punish that, but <laughs> It's actually a really advanced technique. That's why you can't see he seems to be uh, doing some mind games right now He's really getting him on edge. Oh, man So how how does mafia go? Um, essentially there's usually for every like 10 people, there's like three mafia. And what happens is they, people all sit in a circle and they're like, okay, there's three mafia. All you guys have to do is figure out who the mafia is. All right, that's easy enough, go to bed. And then when you wake up, somebody died. And you have to figure out who the mafia is based on who died. Ooh. And one more person dies each night. And if the mafia ever outnumbers the normal townspeople, they win. Mafia wins. But if town can kill all the mafia, then town wins. That's a, okay. That's it's really, really fun. fun. It's just a lot of how well you know the people around you. Yeah. He got reset. <laughs> Look at how happy DDD is to get reset. So <laughs> we know Mike has practiced that combo in the training room for a while. <laughs> he pokes him in the belly button and uh, then he crawls around. You know, dash attack is different in ultimate. Oh, for who? And there's the down B. For uh, Wario. Yeah, it's now the shoulder bash from his original games. Oh, I like that one. That one right? was my favorite. Doesn't he, like, slide in this one? What do you mean? Like, like... Yes, he does, like, the dolphin nose dive and just... And, like, touches them. Slides in, exactly. Very light love tap. So, we're seeing a resurgence 
of the initial Mike and Thor matchup issues. You see, whenever Thor commits to maining a character, Mike just beats it. But whenever Thor goes a random character, say Donkey Kong, there's just it's just so random. <laughs> there's no he way goes, there's no way Thor can lose. He goes Purple Monkey on Battlefield. I do enjoy Purple Monkey. I do too. Like that's one of my favorite things to do. It's just Purple Monkey. <laughs> Same. Um, so yeah, to I the viewers know. at home, Thor's favorite color is purple. Yeah, I was actually just about to uh, about to <laughs> say. You know, I think sad. most people's favorite color should be purple. Oh really? Oh, yeah, I was about to say I love purple. Oh, is that your favorite color per chance? It is. Ooh. That's why now I'm voting for Thor. There's gonna be some real bias here. Oh <laughs> well, there you go. Michael, what's your favorite color? Green. Okay, so it's green versus purple here for favorite colors. Because Michael Hinman's favorite color is green, everybody. Same with my eyes. Ooh, there you go. Oh, yeah. It. Okay, cool. Thanks to our local Mega Man. Tries to waft. Doesn't get it. We just see the uh, bike approaches get snuffed out by Thor. He's doing the cause of ruckus. Shouts to Stephen Hawkins. He slaps the ground. Oh. He tries he to side B him. I don't know how that was going to work. Up B's. He's safe. Back throw. Edge guard and DK is actually pretty tough. So who else coming to the mafia thing? Um, Mike will be there. Thor nice. will be there. Me, Corey, Caleb are always there. You know Cole's coming. Do you guys do it like every time after this? Pretty much, yes. I'd never have come. Dude, you gotta come over to Mike's. The Ramblin' House is where it's at after a weekly. I don't even know where that is. We can show you. Okay. I have space in my car. Oh, sweet. Or you could be like Matt Duvall, Mr. Idiot, and just sort of uh, walk there. Just what? You just sort of walk there. It oh, is in snap. walking distance, but you gotta be a doctor idiot to do that. Yeah, I was about to say, walkies for suckers. Yeah, you know it. Right, this is not the winners, this is losers. A tense match between uh, these losers here. Not losers Black. in my heart. Oh, it's the stupid dare. That was um, a great match. A decisive but stupid 2-0. <laughs> I loved it.